There we go. Come here. There. Hi. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Don't forget. Oh yeah. The black eyed peas. <laughs> Tell them how you used to do it in um college. Oh. Oh, oh, with the rice and the black eyed peas and we chop up some wieners and it went forever. <laughs> oh, come towards me here, too. <laughs> You're so far away. Scrape, scrape. This is the scrape. preferred neuropathy method of love. Instead of a hug, I get this. Kissing's bad breath, too. Yuck. Especially yours, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, they, they don't let him in the floral department because all the roses will mm -hmm. when he walks by. You know? It has Matt T. Come out. It's just really sad. It's, uh, yeah. Speaking of hazmat, we stayed home from church because we didn't want to infect all the cute little babies with whatever we've got. Really? Mm. Or the good upstanding church people. We yeah. wanted them to still be upstanding, not bent over. And, yeah. That sounds wrong. I mean, hacking into a bucket or something, that's what I mean. Hacking, yes. Yeah. Hacking yeah. is good, no. Yeah, hacking. Yeah. Shall we hack for them? No, never mind. It'll just come naturally, <laughs> Just let it express itself naturally. Yeah. Remember, yeah. We, we, they, they requested you. Some poor fool actually requested you. Somebody else a drank besides me, huh? Somebody else besides you. What was that guy on TV? What was that guy on TV? Was it Earl? Who? Who was the guy on TV? What guy on TV? The guy, he, he had a southern draw like this and a... Was it Earl? No, it wasn't Earl. I forget his name. He would ask his wife to get him a bear. I can't remember his name. Homer Simpson? No, I don't think it was. <laughs> Who is one of the famous guys like that, though? Maybe we'll get a comment and somebody will tell us. Yeah. yeah. Who am I talking to? My, I got my naming centers are damaged you now. I'm like, ooh. Yeah, they can see your scar pretty good with a black and white camera. Here. Hey, want to show them your scar? I don't know if I can wiggle it. <laughs> well, all right, I'm going to go have a beer. You're going to go? We're only mm. two minutes and 40 seconds into the video blog and you're going to bail? It can only take so much, you know. I know, but some somebody wants to see us right now. By the way, we're going to talk for a moment by time. Oh God! No, hey, here, get, give them a good dose of the usual. Yeah, I'll, I'll I'll kick back here. The Earth goes around the sun once every 365 days a year. And a quarter. 365.25. Yes. That's why we have a leap year every four years. Yes, dear. Um, and the Earth goes every 24 hours. It spins on its own axis. So you got all this spinning and revolving. <coughs> do you mind? They have all this spinning and revolving. And for some reason we call that time. So Revelation 21.4 says we're going to have an eternity. Does that mean the earth will either stop churning or revolving? I mean, there won't be any more time. Well, hmm? stop thinking in three dimensions. Oh, okay. Yes. How many universes are there, Lord? I have so many questions for him, and he says we're on. See, this is the problem with being really smart. You have all these existential questions. E equals MC squared. MC squared equals E. So, energy moving up the... Never mind. <laughs> yes, dear. I got him and my dad talking one day about nuclear fission. My my mom had to take the phone away from I my dad and hang so it up. I love him so much. I love him. Yes. I'm just, I'm just not very smart when it comes to trigonometry and calculus, so I can't understand. By the way, Dad's still Einstein. pretty sharp. He's um, doing trigonometry and chemistry tutoring, and he's um over 70 years old. We just have to get him moved down to Houston. He doesn't. He's not a big fan of humidity, and I don't uh, think he would um. Like the Texas State Bird. Like George Bush is here. He could be Junior? A no, Junior's out in Crawford. Oh uh, no, Senior. Senior's in in, mes in the hospital. Eighty-eight years or no, they could share the same room. Why would he want him? That's true. 
I mean, not, nothing against Dad. He's been a, you know. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna stop. <laughs> you better stop. <laughs> so we went to work today. <clears throat> we had to get up at two in the morning. Well, I did because yeah. I'm more spiritual when I do my God time. So. I want him to hurry up. So, um, Dad did my God time, sort of. I was pretty sick coughing all night. And so was Ron. Second Peter 3 9. He wrote it just for me. Well, Ron, tell him what it is. God says, I am a thousand years as a day, as a day is a thousand years to the Lord. I am not slow, like some people count slowness. Well, that's why you're cutting your head off. Oh, my head. Uh, your head. You're like, Lord, I love you, You never get my names. That's so unfair. But you're slow, Lord. Come on. So we went to work. Got the Dr. Pepper. The nice man helped me unload the pallet. And, um... I paid everybody in cash. So paid everybody in cash. The bank. Got the, um, sandwich delivery. He's having a good time. Um... And we got him to fix the door from the cafeteria to his credit union. Yeah, they wouldn't let... It wasn't letting us in the credit union, which is pretty funny, because I wanted to sell him some holes of quarters. And they were laughing at me trying to get through the security door, and it wouldn't let me through because it has a big glass panel. On it. All they had to do was push a button and it stop working. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. They had to allow us back. I'm sure the credit union is going to have something to say to the office for that. Thanks a lot. We just got rid of them. Yeah. yeah. So life was finally getting good for a change. And Merry then. Christmas. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I need to de-terrorize you. And don't oh. don't say the terrorist thing. Okay. Yeah, because then I'll probably get banned from YouTube. But I'll be good. I need to de-terrorize you. Yeah, you're stripping a little crowder. Muhammad died. He's still dead. Yes, he is. Buddha died. He's still dead. Yep. I'll never live. <laughs> I'm going to get shot. <laughs> Sorry. I was just kidding. Someone's going to declare jihad. You know my real name is on this? <laughs> Thanks, Ron. <sighs> anyway, Jesus died and he came back. Yes, dear. So I know. I know one book. That's why I hand out Bibles. Oh, I got my prison Bibles today. They look pretty awesome. Um, so when my thieves are arrested, I'll go evangelize them. I can't help it. Every Sunday when they say, if anybody needs a Bible, please raise your hand. The guys are coming down the aisles with the Bibles. I'm always tempted to raise my hand. I always like gesture at him when he goes by. And, like, oh, over here. and he always laughs at me. And he says no. One day they're going to hand me a Braille Bible. You have a Braille Bible. In I fact, this is what I... Uh, Ron's such a good Christian. Our friend Justin gives us a ride to church. So, Ron's leaving his Braille Bible for the Book of Acts and Romans in Justin's trunk. So poor Justin's driving around Houston with a Braille Bible in his trunk. <laughs> well, if he meets a blind, <coughs> he meets a blind guy on the side of the road, they can give him a Bible instead of money. <coughs> Sorry. <laughs> blind people normally have a disability check. Yeah. That's true. Uh, a lot of them can't read Braille anyway, I bet. Mm -hmm. like I used to get NFB things and I worked at that independent living center. And they were always ranting about Braille and literacy. That everybody uses the um, digital recorders. And that nobody knew how to use a slate and stylus or read braille anymore. Although the state always sends Ron his um, junk mail in braille, like um, a very important meeting announcement or something we're not even going to. And uh, four pages of braille just to say that. And Location announcements. Like we're going to yeah. sell our house and go get a new one. No, I like what you said. We're going to die in this house. It was so aggravating buying this house. Our First of all, our real estate agent was a stripper. My friend found her naked on the internet. <laughs> she kept flashing me. And she's like, oh, oh, did I mess up? You know, you can show him a lot of cleavage from Ron. I mean, not that it did any good. I mean, he's blind. Totally blind? Yeah. Can't he, see sun at noon? We had another, we had an employee who did that once, so... She was always flashing cleavage at Ron and he's mad at her. It never worked. And he'd actually be yelling at the cleavage. It was pretty funny. Mm, I a, that one. a flash magnet? Mm, 
there's just something about you, Ron, that just makes a woman want to... Open wide with them. Oh, oh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. We're not going to go there. Oh. Moving right along. Oh. Yes. You know, I was a member in good standing on YouTube. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. But, um, so... Yeah, I can't have you out doing me. <laughs> yeah, Ron a lot more virile <coughs> than... <coughs> So we didn't go to church Sunday because we didn't want to spread this. We didn't cloud. want to take that to church, no. no. Even though they probably had really good things on the table. The gift of, the gift of giving that keeps on giving or something like that. Yeah, everybody at work is already sick, so. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Our driver was sick this morning, too. I'm glad. Oh, yeah. So I was really happy about that. Yeah, me too. And, um, and then we got a straight trip home. Thank you, Lord. Yeah. Nice driver. And he came early. Yeah, he was there when I went out. But in the right driveway. He said, we must have some clouds, get some pool. Yeah, he thought we had some real pool. I'm like, yeah, that's why they were two hours late taking us to church last week. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, <sighs> so. They pulled him off another route and told him, go pick him up. He came right over. I felt like a rock star. Yeah, and then he got to go home after he dropped us. He was real happy about that. Yay! Yeah. Yeah. Poor thing probably needed to go home after taking us. I had a big cardboard box full of all these leftovers from work. They had a New Year's Eve party that involved shrimp, panettone. I've learned something. I don't like panettone, that, that Italian bread with the orange peel. Oh, try I love bite. sugar. Mm. I, I got rid of it. Good. It's got sugar. You wouldn't oh, like it. Oh, I don't like it, no. Yeah, and then some Mexican things. There's this Mexican cinnamon thing that's really good, but I'm not going to eat it. You know, those. we could get filthy rich if we could can that idea with a back creme, making yeah. sugar taste awful. Yeah. Could sell it to diabetics. Yeah, or, or, or implement it on diabetics. Yeah. You know, the way that the medical system's going now. Yeah. You know, diabetes is going to be huge. I wonder how long it is before they start oh, turning God, it Oh, God, have you seen the new ambulance commercial? No. Chasers? They talk about if you had a relative or a friend who... Oh, the dialysis. Yes, yeah. yes, dialysis. Oh, my God, it's so sick. Well, they're messing with your electrolytes. You're going to have be at a risk for that stuff. <coughs> <coughs> that goes Anyways. With the, that goes with the territory. The grass is green, you know? I mean... Yeah, exactly. You're pretty much dead if you're on dialysis. You know? They want to make money off of you before you die. Yeah. Before you go, let us milk you. <laughs> yeah. Something sick. I mean, we never sued anybody. Even though... Well, we sued the guy who ran you over. I saw him again today. He's looking pretty good. It's always <laughs> weird seeing him. Just hey, at least he got me a life flight helicopter in the hospital. Yeah. Well, I'm sure he was blubbering now when he called. It's not like he said send a life flight. They, he described your injuries and <coughs> they're like, oh, yeah, he needs a life flight. <laughs> You, you, he, he, because remember, he looked okay, except to for his head. head. <laughs> <laughs> Who the brain is located. Except for his head, yeah, you know. And even ten years later, he's got all the scarring. I'm just like, oh, dude. So. so, anyways, we have a ton of leftovers, because we didn't want to order a pizza and get the poor delivery man sick. And I didn't want to go to Walmart and get the poor cashier sick. Um, I might even celebrate Thanksgiving tonight. Oh, yeah, you never eat your Thanksgiving dinner. So. <laughs> My treasure. His Thanksgiving TV dinner. You have two of them, by the way. <laughs> hey, I get corn, I get turkey and dressing, mashed potatoes and gravy, corn, cranberry sauce. How much of it is the cat getting? I'm not discussing that. 